Don't ask what the world needs. Ask what makes you come alive and go out and do that. That's one of my favorite Howard Thurman quotes, and it really emphasizes my belief that every single one of us has the capacity to live a life that feels absolutely epic. And I mean by that empowered, purpose-driven, innovative, and collaborative. And we get there by harmonizing all those things in the outer game that we're chasing harmonizing, not balancing, harmonizing them with the inner game. And how do we do that? That means that we have to learn how to get out of our own way, how to stop tolerating showing up as our own worst enemy. And absolutely, that means rather than trying to dodge the boulders or feeling shame about all the boulders in our life, to learn to embrace those boulders. In 2016, my youngest daughter was literally crushed by a falling boulder in Colombia, South America. And we thought, all predicted that she would not survive that. I can tell you, we had some amazing assistance from those doctors working their magic in the outer game. But you know what else was kind of like this magical ingredient? It was this inner game. And I'm not saying that your inner game alone can change some outcomes, but what it can do is allow you to tap in this kind of energy that almost can feel like magic. So yes, my daughter survived, and this I now know, that we may not get to choose how long we get to play on this amazing planet, but we definitely get to choose how epically we live while we are playing here. And those boulders they're often not coming to destroy us. They are coming to de destroy the things that we have been allowing to keep us believing that we are so small. So today, stop defining yourself by your scars. Let your scars cry out that you are mightier than the frickin' boulders that tried to bring you down. Today is your moment, your opportunity to go out and unleash the epic you.